Hi everyone. Today I will show you how to do the 3D modeling in AutoCAD 3D. Uh, we are going to model this 3D object in AutoCAD. After modeling of this object in AutoCAD, we will apply the material to this component. So let's start. Make sure you are in AutoCAD 3D here and we are in the AutoCAD 3D environment. First, we will go to top view here. Create a circle diameter 40. And now we create a center from the circle. It is 57.5. And now we create a circle here, diameter 70. You can see that this diameter is 70 and radius is 20 and distance between them 57.5. Now we will create a line from the 10 to 10 of this one. Now we will mirror this one. We will mirror this one. Now we will trim this one in these circles by typing TR. And our bottom part is completed. Let's go to Southwest Astromet Metric View here. For extrusion, we need to be a single entity. For that, type region, REG, select all. And now it is a single entity. Click on extrude. Give height 15. The height is 15. Now we will draw these two circles, dia 25 and dia 15. We will create circle. Dia 25. We will create circle again. Dia 15. And now we will extrude this one. Click on extrude. Select both. And this one we will throw, so we will do it later on. and we will give height 5. We will copy this one. To center of this one. Click on conceptual to see in solid modeling. You can see that we created these circles here. Now we will create this bigger one. Dia is, dia is 55 and height is 25. Again, click on Southwest, come back to 3D modeling here, circle, center of this one, dia 55, click on extrude, height is 25. So now we will create a 40 dia circle, height 20. Again type circle, center of this circle, dia 40. And 
right click change property and make this one 20 extrude height 20 so you can see that we get the basic shape and now we will make a hole and do the fillet now we will join this all together a single piece now right now it is a different different right so for joining you have to click on union select all the objects enter now it is a single piece you can see that type C center of this circle dia 15 we will come in 2d and we will extrude this one to through same way we copy this one we will paste here same way we will copy the circle and we will see the diameter of this one is 25 so you click change properties so you cannot change the diameter here so we will create a circle here dia 25 again click on extrude enter and through so we will back to conceptual now we have to subtract these cylinders to make a hole on it click on here subtract select this object enter select which you want to subtract enter you can see that we created the hole and now we will provide a fillet here this is 2d and then you have to click on solid click on fillet edges select this one type radius and give radius 5 same be here same be here enter then click on home and make it conceptual So our object is completed here. You can see that we model this basic shape in AutoCAD 3D. So in this way we can do the 3D modeling in AutoCAD. So now we will apply the materials to in it to this component. For applying material, you have to always select on real elastic here. You can see when we click on real elastic and it's perfectly showing this one. You have to click on visualize here for applying the material and select on material and texture make it on so here keep that just one and this is the material library here and 
these are the materials which is available here and here you can select from the library this is Autodesk library you have to select here and you can find ceramic concrete but we will apply metal one here and these are the metals let's say we will apply brass for that you have to change the environment on and here you have to adjust the exposure these are the appearance you, you can change and play around now you can see that we apply copper in this way from here you can apply any material you can change the background also of the screen here click on custom click on background and you select solid you can change the color if you want to make it white or apply and ok or you click here again and you can make it ingredient it will be like this so you can apply any color on the background so we apply here brass and you can adjust the exposure here to adjust this is a machine this is a rust one here this is a stainless steel so in this way you can apply any material to these components this is galvanized this is a gold one hope you understood how to do the basic 3D modeling in AutoCAD. If you have any comment related to this tutorial, please comment in the comment box.